guys, welcome to Horse Hacks um, and this is the next episode in our series of product reviews on uh, Pommel and their various equestrian products. Um, so the one that I'm going to try today is Leg Up. Uh, this one is paraben and silicon free. It's also cruelty free and it's made entirely of natural ingredients. Um, the main aim of it is to um, stop dry and cracked hooves, which is something that Lolly does um, kind of have trouble with. Obviously, uh, your first line of defense is to kind of um, deal with that through diet. Um, however, it's great to use products that kind of give you a little helping hand or a little helping hoof. If you haven't done already, check out, you've got an itch. <laughs> if you haven't done already, check out the product review that I did on Velvet. It was absolutely awesome. Really impressed with how Lolly's legs came out. Um, so I'll post a link to that at the end. Lolly's really prone to thrush and CD toe. Um, he's also really prone to uh, cracked hooves. Um, his toes do tend to uh, get quite long, so I have to alter his trimming cycle throughout the year, uh, particularly in the uh, summer and the spring. He will have to have a shorter trimming cycle. Um, at the moment, he's got quite a bad crack in his um, in his toe because of CD toe. So the farrier's actually dug that out, and I use um, Artimud um, just to pack that in. And then I also use um, horse lead hoof clay as well, um, just to pop um, all around his frog and on the sole of his hooves. Um, I also use a uh, metal brush. Um, I get through about two of these a year. As you can see, this one needs replacing um, I just buy a cheap one from Screwfix or sometimes Amazon uh, whichever just happens to be more convenient at the time and I give his uh, the sole of his hooves a really good scrub with this um, and then I apply the clay and then what I will be doing for the uh, outer hoof wool is um, giving them a good scrub with this applying lots of water and then I'll put on the hoof balm to lock in all that moisture as well um, so yeah let's get started just here is where I've put in the arty mud um, and I've really pressed that into uh, the crack and where the little hole is um, so now I'm going to apply the hoof balm over the top the uh, hoof balm contains hemp shea lavender and tea tree so it's nat naturally antibacterial and antifungal as well as really nourishing leg up yes I definitely would it complements my existing products really really well um, it really nourishes the hoof because of the uh, shade that it's made with and also um, the other products inside it like the tea tree oil and the lavender also have a really good health benefits for the horse in terms of the fact that they are antibacterial I definitely recommend uh, following them on Instagram because they always have offers and discount codes um, and then you can also keep up to date with all the new products that they've got lined up and are coming out. Uh, they've got quite a few different things for different animals coming out which is quite exciting uh, so check out their Instagram handle down here. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel um, to keep up to date with all the different product reviews, how I'm getting on with Carrie and Lolly, um, also got lots of various bits and pieces coming up. Um, also don't forget to follow me on Instagram I'll be doing some giveaways I run giveaways quite regularly um, and also like little horsey life hacks and also a really good way to get some extra content that I've got on Carrie and Lolly and our progress okay thanks for tuning in guys see you soon bye